forced to move. Greensboro City officials condemned the Summit Avenue apartments where five children died in a fire. Now the people who still live at the complex must find a new place to live. The complex's owner was supposed to fix hundreds of violations by Monday, but hundreds of violations remain. The investigation started after five children died in an apartment there in a fire back in May. All were under eight years old and refugees from the Democratic Republic of Congo. WFMY News 2's Hannah Brewer joins us live now at the apartment complex with more on what city inspectors found. During the reinspection, nearly 700 violations were found, and out of the 42 units, only one of them is in compliance with the city's minimum housing code. I spoke with one man who's lived here for nine months, and he says the conditions are terrible. The house is broken. Everything, no good inside. It's a long time. Is the house take a long time? If you take a shower in top, is the water leaking at the kitchen? Leaks, rotting walls, insects, and no smoke alarms. Just some of the violations at the Summit Avenue apartments. Kalenge Wilson lives here with his wife and six children. The family moved here from Africa, but so far their stay hasn't been comfortable. Every day I'm going to the office and talk to the office. Or oh, they say that we come to repair, we come to repair, but nothing. And now that the apartments are condemned, folks like Wilson will have to find a new home. If you give me the house to, to live, I can take my thing and I go. If you found for me a house, I'm ready every time, every day, every hour. The property owners, Arco Realty, sent us a statement. As part of it, they said, we are working diligently to remove every single code violation, whether it is a result of a tenant damage or changes in a building code. Now, with the units being condemned, the residents have 30 days to vacate their homes.